Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Friday, 19th of May 2023. These trades were shared by HS, who is trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. As you see, the macro 30 minute chart is in downtrend, and using the 5 minute structural chart, we see the price reach an area of the support and it's in sideways. So the range of this sideways channel is still wide and is tradable. So using one minute trading chart, he identified the area of the pullback in the downtrend channel and took two positions and managed to close them both with profit using exit strategy number two. So thank you HS for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Castro or Global Instructor who is trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. As you see the macro chart of 30 minute is in wide range sideways again and we can see the channel here so using setup d he identified an area that the price got rejected at the level of the dynamic resistance and it started to go down and you can see here better in the trading five minute charts that the price got rejected several times at this level therefore he entered here with very good risk to reward ratio and managed this open position and close it with profit so thank you castro for sharing your trades with us the next few trades are those I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you my trades taken on Friday, 19th of May 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ and Russell futures. As you see the macro chart uh, here is showing that we were in uptrend. But during the global session, the price started to go down and tested the previous day close. And we can see that again during the New York market session, the price initially started to go up and tested the previous day high and that got rejected. And during the Fed members speech and also chairman speech, the volatility increased and the price started to go down. It passed the value area low and the price got rejected so when market tested this level around 13,860 and as you see in this candle was going up to test this level of the previous day high I took long positions on the Nasdaq and also on Russell and all these long signals from these charts were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex trader fund accounts and we see the results for today which was very choppy and volatile and we recommend that the novice trader should not trade that but it's still positive and we reached profit factor of 2.27 with 72 percent win rate from these long positions and average win to loss ratio of 0.86 and the largest winning trade was 430 and the largest losing trade was 289 dollars so hope this trade is taken by the PAT system with order flow confirmation is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day and also great weekend.